Happy Monday. Happy day after Mother's Day. I hope everyone had an amazing Mother's Day. Drop in the chat. Tell me what you did. Were you pampered? We had, we hosted a taco bar here at my house just because uh, two days prior, my husband said, um, we have four moms, five moms that we need to try and work in and wanting to get everybody together is so fun. But I was like, I don't, I can't plan anything. What if Lexi's having a baby? And I'm like, well, if Lexi's having a baby, I'll be here at my house with the kids anyway. So let's just plan something at my house. And if she shows up, she shows up and everybody showed up and it was great. I did absolutely nothing and it was glorious. Yes. Oh, planted flowers. Yep. I didn't plant flowers, but I got beautiful flowers. That was awesome. Okay. So tonight, um, what we're going to talk about is I was talking to Lexi and I said, you know, everybody has heard my health testimonial as to why I love these products. I will be a plexus for lifer on the products um, as well will Woody be on lifer on the products. But I don't know that you have ever heard my business story. And the ebbs and flows, you know, like you think it, it goes just in a straight line and how we have done this for um, 10 years. Seriously. So um, right now, here's all, all why maybe this is something that came to me as to what I wanted to talk about is if you feel like you are stagnant, if you feel like you are going backwards, if you feel like you're not doing all the things. Um, there'll just be a couple little tidbits probably from my story that you could pick up. Um, and it's just going to be real life and honest of um, what this last 10 years has looked like. It has, hasn't always been um, emeralds and stage visits. Um, it's been a lot. So we started in 2014. And y'all probably know my story that I've done network marketing before and did not pick this as a network marketing opportunity. I picked this for the products only, and that was for the little bit of products part that I knew about. Um, obviously, I wanted to, it was all vanity. I wanted to lose weight, um, and I was trying anything that was out there. And when Dawn handed me a three-day trial of the Slim and Accelerator, the accelerator, which we do not have anymore, it has been replaced by Edge, um, I brought it home. I Googled the company. I found some stuff, but I was like, I don't, it's like, there's like not even enough to, I guess, know that I was like, this is what I want to do. I just wanted to try the products. And I knew because coming off of five figures in credit card debt and also trying a different um, product that I had spent a lot of money on that I needed to go the least expensive route to get my products. So I joined, back then you joined as an ambassador. Um, and when um, I enrolled, then Dawn got an email right away and she called me and she said, what are you doing? I said, I just want the cheapest price. That's it. I don't, I don't want anything else. I don't, I, I'm not doing this to do this as a business. And she's like, okay, good. Cause I don't know what I'm doing either. So I, I, I couldn't help you. Um, and I was like, okay, perfect. So I started the products. Um, was getting good results. And then I started, you know, you start getting emails um, from the company and you guys back then in 2014, th this was very few and far between emails, very few information. If I wanted information, YouTube was my best friend. So that's where I started going was watching things on YouTube. And I thought after watching a couple of things, um, I thought, huh, well, maybe should we maybe, so then I just started, um, I shared the products with my mom. My mom, if you do not know, was my first ambassador because she absolutely loved the X Factor vitamin um, and the pink drink. So she was my first, I said, well, I think the best way to do this is for you to join. It's silly for you to pay, pay retail because you don't have to have inventory. You don't have to do parties or anything like that. You just order your own products. And she's like, oh, well, yeah, then sign me up. So she was my first ambassador. Um, then... I had a friend that became number two and another friend that became number three. And I went silver. When I hit silver, Dawn called me again and said, you just went silver. I was like, what is that? I, I didn't even know at that point what that was. And 
so it's it's kind of a I mean, we just kind of started sharing with people kind of exactly what we are asking everyone to do is just share a little bit like posting on Facebook. I didn't really do actually the first thing that I ever did you guys was I literally typed up an email, which I should see if I can find it of saying, I'm trying these products. This is what I found. I have no idea what I'm doing, but I didn't know if you wanted to try the products with me literally send it to everybody on my email list. I literally got a phone call from a friend of mine who said, um, was this spam or did you really just send me this email? I'm like, no, I did. <laughs> said that bad. So anyway, um, okay. So from there, uh, from silver, I sat at silver for a very long time. Not, not that long. I, I guess it, it seemed like a long time at the time um, because we kept sharing. Then Dawn and I started doing um, parties. I guess we would go to different places, literally restaurants. Um, we would um, book uh, the alumni house here in Kearney and just say, you know, invite your all your friends. Uh, that was it. And then Dawn would get up and talk about the products. I would get it up and talk about the compensation plan because I had to learn the compensation plan because I had to explain to Woody as to why I should be doing this. Um, so that's what we would do. And so remember this was in 2014, 2015. And then, yeah, what is that? What have I done? Um, yeah, that those, those, uh, you guys in those meetings, sometimes it was just sitting around talking, um, and having people ask questions. And sometimes we were a little organized and there were times where we had 25 to 30 people in the room. Um, and there were some times where it was Dawn and I and maybe one or two ambassadors. The thing is, and this is the first thing that I want you to either write down or have in your memory, is we didn't quit. We just didn't quit. So then um, I remember I was a gold ambassador and Jen Hawkins came out to, went to, was going to North Platte to do a, an event there. And we're like, yeah, we're driving two hours to go see a diamond that is coming into town. And we did a training before, a short training before with the ambassadors. And then we had guests show up. And I was so enamored by Jen Hawkins. She's just so, I mean, exactly how she is now. Real and down to earth. Um, would literally ask us, you know, what brought you here? Um, why are you doing this? Why are you sharing? Um so if you don't, if somebody can answer, ask you that question and you don't have an answer, then that's something, that's the first thing to um, work on for sure is why are you taking the products? Why are you sharing the opportunity? Um, those are some solid questions that you should, if someone asks you that you should be able to answer. So then um, I think I went senior gold pretty quick after that. This was still back in 2015, 2000, early to the, or late 2014. And then um, we went Emerald in 2016. And I was like, oh my gosh, we made it. We're here. We've arrived. Ta-da. And we hit it um, April of 2016. And then we did not hit Emerald status again for four years. Four whole years, we kept dropping in points. I never fell below senior Ruby, but I never, I mean, I was like, what in the world happened? What in the world? That, and that there were times where literally I could tell you, and I, here's the other thing. I have a planner. I use a, an Aaron Condren planner. That's my choice. That's those are the ones that I love. And I have a planner for every year and I have kept them. And the reason I've kept them is because in that planner, I track my points every single day. In addition to that, when I do reach outs, when I contact someone for any reason whatsoever, they're written in that planner in that month. Um, I always get the, the, you can pers personalize this planner, but I always get the ones with the extra pages in that same month so that I can track that stuff. And, um, I can tell you when things were moving in my business, that's when I have the most things written in that planner. Um, because there's days where I'm like, I didn't do a gosh dang thing. And guess what? Nothing is happening in my business. No one's reaching out to me. I'm not, you know, things are not going well. 
Um, so it's always, I'm not, never, I never looked at this as to what Dawn was doing for me or Steph or, you know, being my upline. And there were days though, where I was like, oh my gosh, where's my team? And I'm like, but where am I? It always comes back to me as to what I am doing. So there we sat, Emerald status, but not holding Emerald rank for four years. It had been really easy to quit, really easy. And then we hit it in 2020. Um, if you do not know, to um, to uh, earn the Emerald trip, the Emerald extravaganza, whether it's to Hawaii or Mexico, um, you have to qualify. You The first time that you qualify for Emerald, um, even if it's only one time, you get to go that year. The following year, July to July, July, excuse me, July, end of July, August 1st to July, you have to hit that five months in a row. Okay. So there were four years that I did not um, earn the Emerald trip. Then we hit it. What? Not in a row. It doesn't have to be a row. In that 12 months, you have to hear, hit it five times. Okay. Make sense? So then we hit it again in 2020. But we only hit it like twice that year. So we weren't going again. 2021, we qualified for the trip. And ironically, we went to Kona the first time that we qualified in 2016. Then we went going back to the exact same resort. And I was like, it's, it's a God thing. It totally makes sense. Like you are still doing the right things and doing with the right company, because trust me, there were a lot of things and a lot of new companies that popped up. You guys are still a lot of new companies that are popping up and um, the grass is only greener where you're watering it. I, I will promise you that there is no company better right out there than Plexus ever integrity wise, product wise, um, the executives being as real and honest um, and as Lacey loves Dr. Hartman, Dr. Hartman, the more I listen to Dr. Hartman, I'm, I, I have never felt so safe and secure in a spot before. So we hit it again for two months, maybe three that year in 21, or we qualified in 21. And then we hit it for a full year that we stayed at Emerald status for an entire year. And then we fell off again. And I was like, what, like bawling our eyes out, my eyes out, like, what am I doing? What am I doing? Why am I still here? And I thought one of the thoughts I had was, well, you know, hovering between a thousand and 1500 is not a bad place to be check wise. So, you know, I'm still getting our products paid for. So why push? Why, why, why? And then it hit me. It's not about me. It's not about my points. It's about my team helping my leaders grow and helping other people change their life themselves. So what I realized was it wasn't my team or my points or whatever. It was where I was at with my leadership and what I needed to do to grow myself. So, and that's still a work in progress. <laughs> we're not there. We're not, I mean, we're never finished. A leader is always learning. Um, if you haven't heard that quote before, um, that is a great one. A leader is always learning. And if you're not learning, if you're not working in your arena of your people that why, are, if you don't know what their why is, why they're here, um, how this can help them, how this can better their family. That's a great place to start. 100%. And being able to grow in such a capacity that Plexus offers us is legit. You guys for, I, I don't, we are so blessed, so truly blessed. So now we're back to the point and I'm not going to say again, that we are there, that we have arrived. But we are back to, um, we have held Emerald since August of last year. We have not fallen off. So it's just a matter of, or we've not fallen back. Um, it's just a matter of, again, when I look in my planner, looking back, I'm like, yep, that month maybe was a little slow, but look at the little work that I did. 
So in all honesty, and and you guys, it's not hard work. It's reaching out to opening your back office, tracking your points, understanding why people, if they are not ordering that month, why are they not ordering? Do you have that relationship with them? Because I promise you, if you build that relationship with them, when money falls short and that they think, well, I'll just shut off my Plexus order for that month. They're going to think twice because you have that relationship with them. So, um, yeah, it's, I mean, that's it in a nutshell. I've been here for over 10 years. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not quitting ever because I will not not stay. I will not not have these products in my house and to see what they've done with Lexi's family and all y'all on, on the call. Um, with taking the products and how it's changed your health and um, how it can change your finances with a little bit of work. I often say um, to myself, when I look at my month, if I'm like, what happened? I'm like, um, would you hire yourself again after that month? There's some months where I can say, no, I probably would have got fired if that was a real job. But thankfully, every day is new and we have those blessings that we can start over again, for sure. Um so yes, Lacey, arrows out for sure. Um, and then when those arrows start coming in, uh, that negative talk can be absolutely uh, devastating. So make sure you have someone you can communicate with, whether it's someone on our team, whether it's a sideline sister, um, you know, it's, it's real easy just to sit in the negative pool um, and talk about other people and what they're doing wrong and what they're not doing. And, oh my gosh, did you see this person jumped and uh, to another company? And, oh my gosh, I, I, you know, cannot believe that this is happening to me. Um, when instead having that person to be able to say, okay, let's look at this. What should you be doing? What should you be focusing on? And if you need help with that, again, reach out to one of us. We would love to be able to Talk that through, not that we know all the answers for sure, but that's what helps us all grow as leaders to um, get to where you want to go. Yes, blinders on for sure. For sure. If you're looking from side to side, um, that can be, and that was one of the times between 2016 and 20 when we hit it again. Uh, me watching everybody else continue to grow and um, maintain their status and not fall backwards. And it happens more times than you think. And the only reason I want to tell you that is because I want you to know that it can happen, but what can happen and it, the, the, the build back is even sweeter, no matter how many times you have to do it for sure. And I will continue to build back every single time for, because I, I truly believe that this is, this is a God, this is God's gift to so many. And we just have to open our mouth about it. Okay. Does anybody have any questions? Amen. Yes. Does anybody have any questions for me? I, I'm an open book. Ask me anything. Oh, oh, the baby, the sweet boy. Okay. If nobody has any questions, Lexi can go ahead and turn off the recording.